Thyssenkrupp Marine Systems, TKMS, offers third-generation MECO A210 frigate to the Royal Australian Navy, RAN during Indo-Pacific 2023 Thyssenkrupp Marine Systems, TKMS, unveiled their third-generation MECO frigate design, called the MECO A210. The company also confirmed their intent to offer the design to the Royal Australian Navy, RAN, as part of any requirement for Tier 2 combatants. Rear Admiral, retired, Jonathan Commerman, a senior naval advisor at TKMS, told Global Defense Corp that the MECO A210 was a natural evolution of the MECO A200, which was itself an evolution of the MECO 200. Admiral Commerman pointed out that the MECO 200 was also the reference design for the Royal Australian Navy's Anzac-class frigates, acquired initially as a lower-end capability to supplement Tier 1 warships. The new design retains its predecessor's combined diesel and gas water jet and refined propeller propulsion system. Combined diesel and gas water jet pairs up two diesel engines with two propellers and a single gas turbine with a centerline-mounted water jet. The water jet allows the MECO A210 design to achieve high speeds when needed while retaining substantial redundancy. The A200 tops at around 3,600 tons, and the A210 displaces more than 4,700 as currently designed. It is also slightly longer than the A200, which allows it to accommodate 32 strike length MK41 vertical launching system, VLS, cells forward of the bridge. The design was also shown with a CEA Seifer radar, which is nearly ubiquitous across the Tier 2 combatant competitors, and a towed array sonar. In addition to the MK41 VLS, the design is also armed with 16 naval strike missiles, a 127mm Vulcano main gun, multiple remote weapon stations, a conventional close-in weapons system, CIWS, as well as a directed energy weapon in this case, the MBDA Rheinmetall 20KW. The A210 design has substantial power generation and storage capabilities. A200 exceed the demands of the 20KW system and is intended to keep the ship relevant into the future as more powerful dues come online. The MECO A210 design incorporates a large mission bay, which can be used for uncrewed vessels, underneath the naval strike missile launchers. It also has space allocated for ISO containerized payloads on top of the hangar, behind the SeaWiz. This space was used by two containers containing missile launchers associated with the Rheinmetall Sky Shield Short Range Air Defense System, SHORAD. Tizenkrupp confirmed that it is in discussions with an undisclosed local partner about supporting a possible build. Thanks for watching. Thanks for visiting this YouTube channel. Visit GlobalDefenseCorp.com. Follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube, and TikTok.